All right, it's time to have some fun and play fetch with our dog. We're gonna need a few things. One, you probably wanna chuck it if you wanna save your shoulder. Two, we're gonna use this long line. And finally, we want two toys of equal value, okay? Now, before we start, I wanna show you guys a tr little cool trick to prevent your long line from getting tangled. So we're gonna need a close-up shot of this. What you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna place the leash in your hand just like this, and you're gonna feed one end into through that loop. And you're gonna create another loop when you do that. And you're gonna feed it through again, creating another loop. And you're gonna continue to do this all the way. You see, once you get it down, it goes pretty fast. It's like anything else, it becomes muscle memory. And I'm just doing the same thing all the way down the entire length of the leash. So every time I finish playing with my pups or if I'm using a long line for training, I always wrap it up this way. And then when we get to the end, we just go ahead and clip it. And then this is going to prevent you from having a leash that gets knotted up. I mean, you could take it just like this, throw it into your bag, you take it out, it's gonna be just the way it is right now. And then all you do when you're ready to use it is you unhook the leash. There we go. And then it's going to slide all the way through and you'll be ready to use your leash to train your pup. All right, so Charlie knows this game. So he knows what we're doing, although he doesn't really need the long line anymore, although he's pretty excited. And what you wanna do is you wanna hook the long line to your dog. All right, so we have the leash on our dog. We're gonna take the toy. What you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna throw the ball the length of the leash. All right, so I'm gonna toss it. I'm not gonna hold it. I'm gonna let him go after it. You can see the leash really isn't that long. And then what you wanna do is you wanna grab the leash and guide your dog back to you. Now, he already knows this game, he understands it. So he's coming back to me and he's dropping the ball because he knows that I have the next ball right here for him. So I throw that, he goes and gets that ball. We would grab the leash, guide our dog back in, show him the new ball. And if he doesn't want to drop it, we just lift up on the leash. Free, and then we throw the new ball. Good boy. He comes back, out, show him the toy, throw it. He gets the ball, he comes back, out, show him the toy. And again, if he doesn't drop it, there he goes, dropped it, and then we throw it. Be careful that the leash doesn't go around and catch your leg. Good boy. Good job. Woo. Now, as I said, he already knows the game. He knows he needs to bring the ball back. But this is why we have the long line, because some dogs will take the ball and they will go run off with it. The long line gives you an opportunity to guide your dog back in, show them the new toy. They drop the old one, you throw the new one, and then you continue to repeat this until your dog is coming back just like Charlie here without having to use the leash. And then when you get to that point, and he's doing it the way you want him to. Oh, then you can go ahead, unhook the long line, wrap it up nicely so it doesn't get tangled, and you can play fetch the way you always wanted to with your dog without needing that long line. Your dog comes back, and I like to use the chuck it. This is a good way to wear them out. And he's gonna go nice and far. Good workout. Another thing that's fun to do when you're out with your dog playing fetch is to incorporate a little bit of obedience. Out. So I like to give my dogs a couple commands. Spin. Free. You almost didn't see that one. Then I could pick up the old ball. He runs back. Good boy, Charlie. Good job, my man. Out. He drops the ball. Sit. Free. <laughs> there he goes. So now we're throwing in a little bit of obedience and we're having some fun with our dog at the same time, giving them a great workout.